Man. Michael is not having a good day today. Even though it's already been at least a couple of days in game, but. <laughs> what the hell? Please don't fling your poo at me. <laughs> Aliens? Really? Just when you think your day can't get any worse, then you get the good old anal probing your ass. Oh, dear lord, no. No probing. My butt is exit only. No entry. Man, you guys are ugly sons of bitches. Dear God almighty. That is one bad trip, Mr. Mikey. Oh my god! Hmm. It's not such a bad trip anymore. I'm flying, baby! What do you want, do, do, do. I was a good do, do, do. It's so beautiful up here! Oh my god, can I get some more of that shit? I wasn't really feeling it before, but... Wow! That's some good shit, man! I want to go flying. Flying so high in the sky. Tripping like a motherfucker. Oh my god, everything is so beautiful. And then we splat into the ground because we have no parachute. Time to slow yourself up, Mr. Mikey. Probably bust out your parachute now, but you probably forgot it. Oh, dear lord. Well, I guess I don't need to do any drugs myself, because this is plenty trippy for me. And the beautiful music to go along with it all. My god. It's so glorious. Alright, time to crash. Whee! Oof. What the shit? That's all, folks. Looks like the Looney Tunes... ...thing. I don't even know what the hell you call that. That's some good shit, man. Can I get some more of that, please? Yeah. Not really down with the whole puking part, but... Oh, sweet. Somebody left me a bike. Me, you little shit. Oh, dear lord. I'm still wasted. Time for some nude bike riding. Oh, sweet. At least I'm, like, right near my house. Um, I forget how to ride the bike, apparently. Oh, do I just have to hold A? Thought I needed to, like, tap that shit. No? Oh, pardon me, sir. <laughs> Crazy bike rider coming through. No, that's, that's a bunny hop. That's still shooting. Like, no matter what I'm on, that is apparently always shooting. And break, and forward... I don't know, maybe it's because I'm just still... Yeah, I think it's because I was still kind of out of it. That I just can't put that much into my bike ridings. Well, at least I still have my beautiful baby girl at home with me, right? Hello? Honey, I'm home. Oh, no. Michael. It's a dear John letter. You finally lost your mind. Your recent behavior and the company you've been keeping already had me very concerned. Now you've taken to attacking my Fabian, who is a close friend. And then Jimmy said you took drugs while driving him in your car. <laughs> well, we've decided to move out for a while. 
a while. You promised me you'd change, and you haven't changed a bit. I know you say I always act like I'm in a movie. Well, this isn't that. I think I'm gonna speak to a lawyer. I'm just really confused. Please, don't try to contact us and try not to get yourself killed. Amanda. <laughs> Fuck. Hey, do me some yoga and cry like a baby. Did somebody say yoga? Wow, it took me 18 minutes to do that mission. I got warrior, I got triangle, and I got praise the sun. I am a yoga master, baby. Poor Mr. Mikey. At least he put his clothes back on that I changed him into. Except those are different pants. That might be a different jacket. But I saw those clothes in his closet. And I thought about wearing them. But I didn't. Ooh, I can do more yoga. How did I get 3,000? Oh, probably because Jimmy took his, uh... His whatchamacallit. His money out of my account and... Then he apparently left me all by my lonesome. I must center myself. Work on my chi and shit. This doesn't look like... Oh, I was gonna say, that it didn't look like the most ideal uh, yoga outfit to be wearing. Of course, then again, I am not a yoga master, so... I don't know, maybe it's okay to do yoga in any damn thing you feel like wearing. So is there actually any point in doing this? Does it give me any kind of, like, stat boost to my stamina or anything? Or is it just another time-wasting activity? Well, honestly, all the activities in this game ha seem to have some sort of benefit, you know, like, tennis, you know, obviously that gets up your stamina and maybe your strength or something like that. And obviously car races get you money and better driving stats and stuff like that, but I don't know, they didn't didn't say if there were any benefits to doing doing more yoga on my own time. And once again my mouth hole is lined up Perfectly with my anus. Nothing feels better than that, baby. It's all about lining up the mouth hole with the anus. <laughs> I wonder if he'll actually get better or if he always sucks at it. Because it would kind of inter be interesting to see him as like a yoga master. Busting out those moves with no cares in the world. And exhale through your anus. Feels good, doesn't it? Such beautiful and chanting music to do our poses with. Planking! Mr. Mikey, he's planking. There better be some sort of benefit to all this time wasting wastiness. To be like now you can have sexual intercourse with anybody you want because you have unclogged your chakras or something. I don't fucking know. This shit over yet? <laughs> Oh, this is the final one! And we have successfully completed another yoga session. Oh, I feel so much better. But he still hasn't cried like a baby. Did we get anything for that? Nothing? Just... Totally pointless. Let's check out our stats. Oh, my stamina's all the way up anyway, so that wouldn't even, like, put my stamina up. Got good stealth, decent driving, awesome stamina, good special. 
Alrighty, it has been quite a while since we have checked in with Mr. Trevor. Let's see if he's got any super exciting shit going on. Wow, he's like just a very tiny little ways away, away from Mr. Mikey. I'm a hipster! This is ironic! Come on! Your outfit? Or something else? What's ironic? Alright, I guess we are nearby some sort of mission. Ooh, look at those beautiful cars. <laughs> Nobody sees nothing. It's okay, this is my best friend's car. I'm just borrowing it for a short while. Oh, Mr. Ron, some Chinese folks stopped by the trailer today they seemed a little angry did you do something to upset them maybe perhaps don't really remember doing anything to upset them other than killing off my competition but I don't see why that's a problem be careful what you say they're listening they're always listening you're never safe anywhere Fear them! Brad? Who the hell's Brad? Oh my god, he's got a ton of emails. Um, Cletus. Hey Trevor, meet me down at the lodge and we'll go hunt some real game. Alrighty, what kind of stuff do we got? More gun stuff, don't really care about that. Property. Mr. Phillips. Oh my god, I got 12 grand for my airfield. Nice. Big Bad Ron, hello from Sandy Shores, we miss you, T. House Los Santos, there's been all kinds of crazy sniffing about, no one is happy and it's hard for me to do my job as acting CEO of the business. I think you should come back and help me and stay here forever like we discussed. I'm worried that the lizard people will eat you in Los Santos. They are there. Uh, the lost seem to be in a lot of trouble since you paid them your last visit. The O'Neills also seem to have disappeared off the face of the earth. Abducted, I hope, but I reckon they'll surface again. Some Chinese fellas was seen sniffing about asking after you in town. I reckon them guys that them I reckon them guys that deal fell through with, but I ain't confirmed it yet. Either way, I'm missing you, your CEO acting Ron. Oh, I can reply to Big Bad Ron. Pick a response! I don't see any way to like pick a different response though. Um, stop being such a pussy! Make us some money and anyone comes near the place, do like I showed you. Ice pick to the back of the head! Drink brains with straw! Okay. Uh, Mr. Bradley. Oh, it's Brad from prison! No, it must be an imposter or something. He's dead. I saw pictures of his funeral. I know. Why don't you come here and visit me? Uh, now ain't the time for visits. Why does it say pick a response when there's only ever one response? That's so weird. Whatever. I'm going with it. I have to go up to my apartment for this mission? I see no kinds of... Oh, I guess I just have... No? Alrighty, I'm gonna say it's in the apartment. I look so sexy in my pink track suit. Track outfit, whatever you call it. Ah, what the hell uh, those assholes are saying about me? That's it, right, yes, Trevor. But the thing is, um, I ain't been with that many women. I don't find it easy, and, um, and Deborah, I mean, we're getting married, so. Oh, that's beautiful. But I'm scared that she's going to leave me. I mean, this is her place, and the fornicating? <laughs> There's Mr. Raspberry Jam. Whoa. What? Now, Mr. Raspberry Jam, he died a noble death, bringing great joy to a lonely man. Someone? I ain't got a very big penis. <laughs> Some girls laugh when they, when they look at it. <laughs> Show me. Yeah, whip Show that me. shit out. I, 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 I don't want to. Whip it out. 
Or I will go fuck you. Oh dear God. Mine ain't nothing special, but this boy gets the job done. Alright? Ladies, avert your eyes. Wade here says that you work at the docks. You yes. Pull your pants up. Me. Can you just <laughs> Wade hasn't away. taken his eyes off my junk. Yes, I work at the docks. And anything uh interesting there for a man like me? Well, I mean, I, I, I don't rightly, rightly know. What kind of person are you? Oh, I'm that kind of person, Floyd. I am that kind of person. Now, let's get you, Wade, and that little tormentor down there. <laughs> put these on. Ooh, new outfits? I'm going for a ride. Gentlemen, I love the presents. gateway to America awaits. That poor abused bear in his eye hole. Man at the port of LS. I'm going to send you some information. I need you on point to help plan things. I got it. I really miss Rejected. There's Mr. Wade always in the back. Go to Pier 400. Can do. Come on then, Floyd. What you got for me? Like I said, I don't rightly know what we got. Uh, you're going to have to be more exact in your questioning, sir. Uh, we're looking for something to steal. Uh, sir, uh, I stole a pencil in elementary school, and I've been regretting it ever since. Floyd always wanted Dear to stick in the mud. God, Look, Floyd. Uh, sir, please, uh, just tell me what you want, and I'll do my utmost to assist you in finding it. Here's the problem. I don't know what I want. It's a bit, well, like pornography or a perfect turd. I can't <laughs> quite describe it, but I'll know it when I see it. No. Aid in my comprehension. All right, all right. Well, how's this? Two hundred and thirty-six billion dollars worth of cargo came through the port of Los Santos last year. He's real good with numbers. I don't want to hijack a truck full of pineapples, Floyd. You need to give us the inside track on what's coming through. We don't know what's in the containers. They certainly don't put brass tags on them. Have you noticed anything? Anything different? Anything that might indicate something? Well, there's been all these uh, Merryweather folks hanging around. Hanging around. Merriweather Security Consulting. Private Army to the New World Order. My butt's gone The folks waging outsourced shadow <laughs> wars in 20 countries around the globe and recently cleared to operate on U.S. soil. That, um, sounds like them. So there's a private militia in the port. What are they guarding? This Weapons? one freighter? I guess now that you mention it, it ain't quite right. A freighter. Perfect. Can I get on board? <clears throat> Hey now. Sorry. No, uh, they won't let you anywhere near it. They're kind of assholes about it, actually. The other day, my colleague Ralph. I don't give a shit about Ralph. We gotta take a look. Is there anything else? There's another bunch of Merryweather guys out by the Navy warehouse. They got boats coming in and out. I heard they was testing something. All right, we'll take a look at that as well. And we will kill many, many people while we're at it. No, wait, I forgot we're like... I forgot we're undercover, so I don't need to kill people, right? Here comes the suit. I gotta check in. Remember, Floyd, this can go real wrong real quick. We got a waste spillage and I got a slot on the cleanup crew. There is nothing that Wade here ain't gonna do for a warm meal. Hope you got a strong stomach, son. <laughs> Get in there. Follow Floyd. Oh, that was Wade that he took. Yeah, it's over here. You ever got helicopters coming in and out of here? You know, those big sky crane things that could pick up a whole container? Now, this is restricted airspace. They won't let anything out of here without clearance. They'll shoot it down if they have to. So how's a man in a hurry supposed to get in and out of this place? Well, we got a port that stretched to 50 feet. 
Now, what's the Coast Guard response like? Well, they got cutters, 45-foot response vessels, air support. You're not gonna move much faster than them, especially if you're carrying something. Maybe I'll have to saddle you up and ride you across the Miriam Turner overpass. Do it! said they have the water surface real covered. Hit him. So that is the freighter I told you about. What do you think they got on it? We just stevedore them. We ain't meant to know what's in the containers. But? But these are marked military. Government. Nice. about that? The government stuff is hot freight. Pulls up, goes right through. This stuff's just been sitting here. You are beginning to arouse my... Penis. Over there, two o'clock. Looks like Forrest got on the wrong side of some Merryweather guys. Well, that's not very nice of you gentlemen. We need two guys on the handler. Couple on the water. Maybe got to be brought up to app. This thing. Question. Get on it. <laughs> you want me to like uh uh I I am not familiar with with how to maneuver you know, such We got to do this. Such a vehicle. This is not going to go well at all. I run that prick over in this thing.